fortune card. <laughs> I forgot where that's from. What? I could have done that. Oh, that's Rick and Morty oh again. He was getting his ass blown out by dragons and he used an ice fell on himself to be like so I could be cold instead of hot. And he just lasted too long. Ah oh, no, ah oh, this is even worse. Ah oh, I should have died from it. Ready for a little some pee pee bro? Should have died quicker. HD remake Wee Wee. Damn. Where is my friend? What? What are you talking about? Why would they always do that? What next? Oh. Snake. Hey, you're that ninja. I've been with our words, Snake. snake. Who are you? Why is it? Neither <laughs> enemy off. nor friend. I am back from a world where such words are meaningless. Yeah, but you're here now where they have obstacles. Didn't you, you say the, you where's your friend to how? Like, death. What do you want? That's, yeah. Oh, I've waited a long time for this day. Now I want to enjoy this moment. <laughs> well, what's with these guys? It's like one of my Japanese animes. What is it? Revenge. It is nothing so trivial as revenge. It's never been about revenge. I just want to fight you. I want to cast hands with you. It's not even about winning or losing. It's about fighting. You will kill me. It makes no difference. Peas in the locker. All right then. Watch from your box seat. I need that man. Keep your hands. So a thing you can do in Metal Gear Solid is you can hold up into a wall and knock to get niggas attention. If you do that to the locker, I think Hal yells. Repeat yourself from there. Give me a sec. <laughs> That's good snake. Really? Yeah? Yeah, I seem to be losing this fight. <laughs> oh, come on! This fight is definitely going in a direction I was not expecting. Japanese to like fuck up with one eye. No. Okay. He's down. You play too rough. I'm going home. Oh god. Yeah, you can you can carry the distance. You can go the distance. Not like this. His hitbox is just astounding me sometimes. What are you talking about? I'm bleeding because of that kick. Shit! I found the strat. 
It's just like sometimes, he, not even sometimes, a lot of times he's just overly invincible. <laughs> That's enough, Fox. Let's go. We'll do this. Oh, me. me and you, nigga. Hands. Close, but he's gonna rape you if you're so close. How? You can't even grab him or choke him, bro. He'll just get out of the grab. He'll choke you back. How? Ray Fox, be better. Stop being mean. I like this more. Wait, how? Actually, how? Feels so familiar. The smoke. I felt that snake. 
Can I also shit whip someone into a wall like this before? Do remember me now? The Fade, we run into each other. It can't be. Great Fox! You were killed in Zanzibar. Is it over? Unlike the original game, where that was actually a phase that you had to fight, Fox. where he was exploding. Colonel, that ninja <laughs> that shit was Fox. pretty good. They took no that doubt out. about it. Ridiculous. You yourself in Zanzibar land. Yes. He should have been killed, but he's still alive. What? It happened before I joined Foxhound's medical staff. They were using a soldier for their gene therapy experiments. I never heard that. It happened right after you retired. My predecessor, Dr. Clark, was in charge. Dr. Clark? Yes. Dr. K. He started Clark. the gene therapy project. And where is he now? He was killed in an explosion in his lab two years ago. So what about this soldier? Apparently, for their yeah, test subject, they decided to use the body of a soldier who was recovered after yeah, the fall of Zanzibar land. Yeah. And that was Gray Fox? But he was already dead. Uh. Yes. But they revived him. They fitted him with a prototype exoskeleton and kept him drugged for four years while they experimented on him like a plaything. Today's genome soldiers were born from those experiments. That's the sickest thing I've ever heard. They yeah, it's pretty sick, dude. All sorts of gene therapy techniques. Naomi, why didn't you tell us about this sooner? Because it's confidential information. Because you never asked. Is that the only reason? <clears throat> Naomi. What happened to Gray Fox after that? The records said he died in an accident. I see. But even if that ninja is Gray Fox, the question is, why? From what I can tell, he didn't know who he was. You're saying he's just living off his will to fight? I'm not sure, but he seems intent on fighting me to the death. We'll meet again. I know it. So you'll fight again? Until you kill him? I'd rather not, but maybe that's what he wants. How long are you gonna stay in there? Huh? Are you one of them? No, I'm not. If I was one I of them, work right alone. Here, I'd be fucking clapping your piss stained cheeks right now. Are you an otaku too? Come on, get out. We can't stay here forever. Shut up. I'll use your tears as lubricant. Your uniform's different from theirs. You're the Metal yeah, Gear Rats chief engineer, Hal Emmerich, right? You know me? I heard about you from Merrill. Oh, so you're here to rescue me? Sorry, but no. There's something that I've got to do first. Oh, well, at least you're not one of them. That's racist. <laughs> hmm. Are you hurt? Uh, I'm okay. 
I just twisted my ankle a little trying to get away. Well, if that's all, it's nothing to worry about. I want to ask you something. I need information about Metal Gear. This is going to be a long cutscene. I'm going to be real with you guys. This is specifically going to be a long ass cutscene. Metal Gear really designed for. It's a mobile TMD. It's designed to shoot down nuclear missiles, only for defensive purposes, of course. Liar! Liar! <laughs> Metal Gear is nothing but a nuclear-equipped walking death mobile. Nuclear? What are you talking about? The terrorists are planning to use Metal Gear to launch a nuclear missile. You telling me you didn't know? Aren't they just trying to use the TMD missile module to launch a disabled nuclear warhead? Wrong. From the beginning, the purpose of this exercise was to test Metal Gear's nuclear launch capability using a dummy nuclear warhead. The terrorists are just continuing the work you started. No, you're wrong. I heard it directly from your boss, Baker. No. A nuclear missile on Rex? So you really didn't know. No. All the armament was built by a separate department. And the president personally supervised the final assembly with the main unit. President Baker? Yeah. I was never told exactly what they armed Rex with. I only know it's equipped with a Vulcan cannon, a laser, and a railgun. A railgun, you said? Yeah. It uses magnets to fire bullets at extremely high velocities. The technology was originally developed for the SDI system and later scrapped. We were successful in miniaturizing it in a joint venture between Arms Tech and Rivermore National Labs. The railgun is on Rex's right arm. Metal Gear's main function is to launch nuclear missiles. You sure you're not forgetting something? It's true that Metal Gear has a missile module on his back that can carry up to eight missiles, but... Are you saying it was originally meant to carry nuclear missiles? Yeah, but that's not all, I think. If Metal Gear fired only standard nuclear missiles, then they should already have all the practical data they need. No. Could it be? Metal Gear's co-developer, Rivermore National Labs, was working on a new type of nuclear weapon. They were using Nova and NIF laser nuclear fusion testing equipment and supercomputers. So they developed a new type of nuclear weapon in a VR testing lab, huh? Yes, but you can't use virtual data on a battlefield. They would need actual launch data. <coughs> These are some of the supercomputers. If you link these, you can test everything in a virtual environment. But it's all just theoretical. So, this exercise was designed to test the real thing. What did our president do? Did the terrorists launch that thing? No. Damn! Damn! I'm such a fool! It's all my fault. The truth is... My grandfather was part of the Manhattan Project. He suffered with the guilt for the rest of his life. And my father? He was born on August 6th, 1945. The day of the Hiroshima bomb. God's got a sense of humor, all right. Three generations of Emmerich men we must have the curse of nuclear weapons you know written into our DNA. About how Emmerich is? I used so to think that I could use science to help mankind. But in the end, his dad was trying I to use him being used. as a little fucking using testing peace? grounds for like That's all these experiments. Basically, as is like a fucking <laughs> training dummy. <laughs> and his mom said, That's "No." Enough crying. Pull yourself. So his dad killed his mom. <clears throat> Where is Metal Gear? I don't Where know if he got tested on keeping it, but he definitely lost the mom because of that shit. Rex and then that the dude remarried. Space. Where's that? He has a daughter the with that person. tower, but it's a long but way that there. Person, the emergency override system for the detonation code is there too. Yeah, with how? This is control room. 
You'd better hurry. So this thing is clapping his stepmom's cheeks, bro. The program is probably finished. <laughs> and the dad finds out he kills himself. Hours, this thing is a weak-willed digger. <laughs> I swear to God. They must be ready to launch. Yeah, has got the detonation oh, code. He killed his kids. wife. We'll link up with her. And then got cucked by his son, and then decided to that's it, Rex. done. <laughs> I'll show you the way. What about your fucking guts? On that leg of yours, you'll just slow me down. You'll need me if you're gonna destroy Rex. I don't need you. I just need your brain. I created Rex. It's my right, my duty to destroy him. If you get a chance, try to escape. When the coast is clear, I'll contact you by Kodak. How am I supposed to escape from an island? <sighs> okay. So what then? I want you to hide somewhere and keep me informed. You know this place well, don't you? Of course I do. And don't worry, I've got this. It's the same stealth technology as the ninja. Foxhound was gonna use them, but... With this, I'll be fine. Bad leg and all. Good. But I want Meryl to watch after you, too. Oh, do I have to fucking play the no. Meryl, the engineer's okay. That's a relief. I want you to look after him. Where are you now? Very close. There she is. Over there. Oh, no. Damn, they spotted me. Yeah, I wonder why. Stop taking Meryl, off your mask for a fucking radio call. Dumb bitch. Oh my god, it's the Something's wrong. Did you hear something? Wasn't that some kind of music? What did she look like? Mario. Oh, I was gonna show that off. <laughs> she she was wearing the same green uniform as the terrorists. <laughs> If she's disguised as the enemy, you'll have to contact her when she's alone, huh? There's only one place where we can be sure she's by herself. Right. Where's that? Don't yeah, be no so shit. dense. Here, use this security card. I love how he doesn't really tell he doesn't tell you go to the it's girl bathroom. He's like, four. don't be a retard. Right. Even though it's the same nigga who said when you escape, call me on codec. How are you supposed to escape from an island? Mm, I guess you're right. You're not in pain, are you? Huh? You feel okay? <clears throat> Nothing bothering you. What's wrong? You get all friendly all of a sudden. No, nothing. I, uh, just glad you're okay. What? You're he's worried strange. that he's gonna have heart attack. Oh, yeah. I'm a little nervous. Everyone else I've saved suddenly dies. Because of what happened to the Your bad luck. Dude. Forget it, Doctor. Call me Otacon. Otacon? It stands for Otaku Convention. An otaku is a guy like me who likes Japanimation. They really put. <laughs> So the end of the Japan was the first well, country to successfully game, make bipedal yeah, robots. Funny. They're still the yeah, best in the field of robotics. And Japanese cartoons played some part in that? They did. I didn't get into science to make nuclear weapons, you know. Yeah, that's what all scientists say. I became a scientist because I wanted to make robots like the ones in the Japanese animes. Really, it's true. Sounds like an excuse oh, to me. You. You're right. We have to take responsibility. Science has progressed because there is war. And because of scientists' greed, weapons of mass destruction were born. But that's all over. I won't take part in murder anymore. Just probably stop hanging out with sleep then. <clears throat> Right. Whatever. All I want from you is information. Sure. I know everything about this whole base. Ask me anything about Rex or about this place. Also, with this stealth camouflage, I can sneak in and out of the armory and mess hall. If you need ammo or rations, just tell me and I'll bring them to you. 
I'm on frequency 141.12. See you later. I get to play the game? Oh shit! Anyways, well, fucking god damn! You might have noticed during the fight there might be a little, a few things, a few things that weren't in the PlayStation game. Shoot it! I don't think this does anything. It moves. It moves away. That one doesn't. And the TV has been able to. Huh. But the cool thing is what you already noticed during the cutscene. Those Negroes. I think that heals you, by the way. It did. Wahoo! Wahoo! That game's pretty dope. I think that's all of the references. Dude, you've been rubbing your eye for a whole minute. You good? Yeah, I just left all the dog hairs in my eye. Oh yeah, you guys got slumped. Get the gas mask. The unslumped the mask. <laughs> Jesus, bro, that nigga's a human swastika. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get shot. That's what I want. I'm out of here. Where? 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 No. no, 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 wait, 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 Fuck me, Boreon. Okay. Nah, it's, you don't, you don't know. No, I know. I, I'm, I know, I know. Fuck, nigga, I hate it. Fuck people. It's everywhere. Yep. People are fucking moving up, little honey. I saw a fucking Not like, even a funny. Uh, no, Vaporeon. Vaporeon. I saw a Vaporeon like merge with Low Punny, so like it had it was a Low Punny, but it had like the Vaporeon color scheme with its face. And I'm like, oh god, you made a bipedal Vaporeon, you fucking perverts. Bro, it's just like <sighs> disgusting. You s I know you're right. But sometimes they're just too good at drawing. Yeah. And I can't. I. 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 I they got me. I'm. I'm done. I'm disgusting. I have to look at men's asses now. That's probably her right there. Yeah, the smaller one. Yeah. I'm gonna kill her. I'm gonna end this episode killing her, like I did last time. Yeah. You can even tell she screamed. Again. What happened? Snake! Snake! I killed your daughter. It was very easy. I killed your not not daughter. It really was very easy. Anyways, let me just get my items back. Box two. So that's definitely her. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, that was the way you walk. What's that supposed to be? 
So a fun way to do this is just, you know, to Whoa! Where'd you come from? Well, it doesn't really matter. Should have killed the fucking bathroom nigga first. Like before, if you make it to the bathroom fast enough. Then she won't have enough time to change. Oh, if you're too slow, Nintendo. she'll pull on. She'll put on pants. Oh, because of Nintendo. <laughs> Don't move. That's the second time I've been able to sneak up on the legendary Solid Snake. <clears throat> Your Meryl. There's no way you could pass for a man for long. What do you mean? Hey, men aren't allowed in here. <laughs> I had no idea you were so... feminine. This is no time to try and hit on me, Snake. <laughs> Besides, it's a waste of time. When I joined up, they gave me psychotherapy to destroy my interest in men. Okay. Same smart mouth. You're Meryl, all right. Are you hurt? Not yet. After all, I was disguised as a genome soldier. So why'd you change? You'd be a lot better off dressed like one of them. I got tired of disguising myself. I don't know myself. about that. <clears throat> my hands are just... Raping the A button. <laughs> the truth is, the uniform smelled like blood. That's not true What's at that all. Mark? It smelled like shit, huh? bro. It was yeah, I really this? did. It's a paint tattoo. It's not real. I'm a no, fan of boxing. Damn well, his outfit smells like one thing. Like you and my uncle were in it. None of that gene therapy like there is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. All the heroes I know are either dead or in prison. One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? I don't like that her skin is darker than her face. Mm. I'm you know just I mean? a guy who can only find meaning on the battlefield. There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. The only winners in war are the people. That's right. And you fight for the people. That's I've never fought for anyone but yeah, myself. Yeah, I've got no purpose in life. No ultimate goal. Oh. Come on. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You can't stop loving war. Is it the same for all soldiers throughout history? Sir. Sure. Why didn't you contact me? My Kodak was broken. Is that all? Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? No. I cast twerk. Anyway, how did you recognize me in disguise? Uh, I never forget a lady. So there's something you like about me, huh? Yeah, you've got a great butt. But? <coughs> oh, I see. First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. What's next? On the battlefield, you never think about what's next. <coughs> so Snake, how are the negotiations going? No progress. So it's all up to you, huh? Somebody's got to stop them from launching a nuclear missile. There are two ways. Either we destroy Metal Gear, or... We override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker? We got the one. Card keys? You mean this? Where are the others? There should be three keys. This is all I've got. Where could the other two be? 
I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. I heard that Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north of here. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. I won't slow you down. I promise. And what if you do? Then you can shoot me. Oh boy. I don't like to waste bullets. So I'm trying to gunning the shit out of her. Oh no, my pants fell. Mm, that's tough. <laughs> then, then, then Snake is the monkey from the picture again? Yup. That's tough. Got <laughs> it. <laughs> yup. Gotta love it. You know, I don't use makeup the way other women do. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. We're doing this, bitch. I despise that kind of woman. You're a tomboy, no one cares. I've always dreamed of becoming a soldier. Uh, the year of our Lord 2023, bro. She wants to be a dude. That's a, that's a guy, bro. It's only my dream. My that makes Snake gay. <laughs> he was killed in action when I was younger. You wanted to follow in your father's footsteps? Not really. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. And so, you became a soldier. I thought I was. Would until today. Now I understand. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself. Afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not gonna lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I want to know who I am, what I'm capable of. I want to know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know. Well, like I said, protagonist, antagonist. Snakes. Take a good look. You won't be seeing mirrors for a while. There won't be any chances to wash your face either. Even though Snake is yeah. the protagonist, whatever. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are riding on this. There are no heroes or heroines. You lose, you die a dog's death. Yeah. Is that Famas functional? Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Where'd you get that Desert Eagle? I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber action express. There was a SOCOM pistol too, but I chose this. That's the gun I got. So I got a leftover, huh? Oh, I took the leftover. Isn't that a gun a little bitch. big for a girl? <clears throat> now you treat me like a woman? Come on, use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. Adopted father, Matt Campbell. If we're gonna go north, we'll have to go through the commander's room on this floor. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. The door to the commander's room is security level five. This card will open it. It was inside the pocket of the uniform I was wearing. So it looks like he must have been guarding someplace important. Roy and his brother fell in love okay, with the same let's woman. Go. Roy clapped cheeks and then decided to man. quit the Marines and leave his brother to the woman he loves. And he let his brother bury the woman he loves. And she gave birth to Roy's kid, who Matt Campbell thought was his Strange. kid. There's no guard. If you're gonna be fucking a nigger about it, don't clap the cheeks, nigga. <laughs> I'll the good old Philip Bellows sure fucking... Ready, okay? Philip Caleb type bullshit. Pocket of coochie. But, we're gonna do this bullshit next time on Let's Play Metal Gear Solid Twin Snakes. Uh, we'll see you guys when I go to the next boss fight and the next several fucking hours of goddamn cutscene. We'll see you guys it's next time. It's a good thing you hooked up with Meryl. You should have seen the Colonel. He doesn't like to let it show because he's the boss, but he was so happy he could barely contain himself. I'm more glad talk. to hear that. Good. More, more. Thank you. Let me save, please. Thank you. Yes. Shit, which one is it? 
I made I made a new file and oh it's gotta be the yeah it's gotta be the the fucking one out twenty three. Dang. Hey, so we'll see you guys next time when I fucking continue forth. Bye, guys. Bye.